Hey you guys, we are passing through Oklahoma and the destination for this vlog is Missouri. We are officially in Missouri! Purchase your tracks today. Baby's out there for a while. Why are you trying to match me? Come on, watch me. You stay trying to match me. What a friend. Alright, so it's glowing. You know, we just got some fuel for the truck. We're about to go in here and get ourselves together. We're at the Petro in Joplin. So yeah, come on in here and check it out. Just your tracks today. Now let me see you walk, 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 walk. What kind of walk was that? <laughs> <laughs> those are slippers, that's crazy. Yeah, that's pretty cool though. Look at the little baby one. I know. That's funny. Get down the road just a little bit more. And we 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 won't stop for today. Gotta get her cleaned up, man. But friendship too is what's been carrying us out here. I don't know. I just don't mind being around my best friend all the time. Well, I'm a bean that little girl. He does annoy me and get on my nerves. It was so hard for me to let that guard down in the beginning and just let Jermaine do for me. Like when I tell you he has never let me hold a grocery bag, he has never let me open a door. It was hard for me in the beginning because I was like, I can do that, I got this. Like, you know, strong, independent, black woman, blah, blah, blah. I'm now walking more in my femininity and allowing him to take care of me. 
but also just because my part doesn't bear resemblance to his does not mean that I bring no contribution to this relationship. So when Jermaine is tired of driving all day long, I'm here to comfort him. I'm here to massage his feet. I'm here to cook something for him so we don't have, he doesn't have to eat truck stop food all the time. You know, um, I'm just here to be a help me period because you know, our relationship is a little more traditional and old school and that's fine. It does not have to look like the world and we're not seeking approval from the world. And we actually did have this conversation in the beginning of me possibly getting my CDL so we can team drive and get that bag, you know. But we've come to the conclusion that it's not all about getting the money for us. Like our marriage is a priority. I feel like the quality time as far as us being together and doing things and having fun and stuff like that. I kind of feel like that it's out the window. it kind of takes a hit you know even it's though still together you right. know in the same truck in the same environment yeah but basically it'll be me driving 10 hours and then my day is done then she'll take over and drive her 10 hours it's just it just depends on what works for, what you, works for you and your relationship yeah. but definitely for this relationship my marriage this union i love providing for my wife you know and everything trust me <laughs> you know I, I do have things that I do want to achieve so once he gets where he needs to be he's gonna help me achieve where I want to be and then we are going to go up to the top together Indeed. that's the plan you yes, know indeed. but we're about to head to the terminal you know what I'm saying and go get a shower so let's ride let's ride let people know you know my wife is a really good helpmate and she really is anything that I need like it's times where I might need help backing up and she's my eyes for me on the back end you know it's trust me it's like with team driving without team driving she does you know all the promoting all the marketing for a couple by the mouths does the editing everything is really her you help me too. I, I, I'll throw my opinions in here and there. Other than that, she does all of this. So everything that you guys see, that's her talent. That's her her editing skills. Well, thanks, baby. Because uh, I really do feel like that. I'm about to put fuel in this trailer. is not inter-personal relationship, but it is intra. So 
So we just got here to the front terminal, so I'm about to check in real quick. So here we got the school store. We got like a little daycare. Here we got the plats of all the drivers that been through here. We got like a little cafeteria. start our day um go brush our teeth and yeah just start the rest of the day so y'all we just got back from getting ourselves together yep we have a big surprise for you guys surprise you will find out in the next vlog what it is but we just got done doing and handling that we got a lot to do today and y'all just stay along with us and you know just Check it out. So that's what it's on. His head. It do match your head. <laughs> going back in there to because he forgot to get changed back from the regular pay for our laundry and I'm about to start putting everything away so anytime we go grocery shopping I like to do like a thorough wipe down in the fridge I mean I clean the fridge regularly anyways but it's like to do like a thorough wipe down and throw out anything that we don't need anymore I will show you guys how I do trying to stuff all this in this little mini fridge it's my smart chicken be so big like what are they doing to it it's like steroids it. but this is the first time that i was able to actually get small chicken wings i was so happy oh he's back you got detergent yeah i got a lot going on back here what's that what's that why you always trying to surprise me Y'all, my baby is the sweetest. Thank you, baby. Are these pajamas? Yeah, they're nightgowns. Oh, cool beans. Yeah. I love nightgowns from Walmart. Like, y'all, they are so soft and comfortable. Like, y'all thought I was playing when I said this man always spoils me. Hey, God, God, may you bless this man. Baby, I really appreciate that. Thank you. 
Okay, we back at the terminal. I'm playing Spider-Man. About to eat on some some good Papa John. Yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Yeah, we out here.